Good morning everyone. Um, today I'm going to be doing a split color Dutch pour. I have some fall colors here and I'm planning on doing white and black for uh, my base coat for my split colors. And I have each color mixed with Floetrol and water. For my other colors, I have a couple of shades of metallics and an orange and a red. Um, I have quite a bit of each of these colors mixed up and I think I'll definitely have enough for a second split color Dutch pour. And in my next one, I'm going to do this red color. This is Pyrol Red. Um, it's one of my favorite reds to use when I'm using red. And I think um, since I haven't done a red split color, I'm going to try out this one. Um, instead of the half white and black, I'm going to do the white and red and then add the black in the middle next time. So for today's video, we'll use the white and the black for the base coat. And I also have my little hair dryer here. This is just my nice little one that I really like to use for my Dutch pours now. And then I just have a couple of sponge brushes so that I can smooth out my white and my black paint. And we'll just start putting some of this down. And just get a nice coat around this half of the canvas. I'm just gonna make sure that my sides are covered so I don't have to touch those up later on. All right, now we'll get our white down. And just get that smoothed out too. excited for these colors. The, the red and the orange and the metallics I think are going to look really nice together, hopefully. And then against that black I'm hoping that they really pop. and the metallics. I'll probably have to mix up a little bit of extra red, but I will definitely have enough for another um, Dutch pour, doing the red for the base coat. Wow, that is really, really nice. I'm getting a lot of really nice cells in here. Um, hopefully everything dries fine, I think it will. I think those metallics are really gonna pop. Uh, but I really like that black and that red together. So I think doing it the opposite of a red background and then the black and the metallics is also gonna look really nice. So I will do that in another video coming up and I will make sure to use up my leftover paint. So if you ever mix up too many paints, you can definitely do um, the same thing. You could do another Dutch pour, you could do another um, technique that you want to do, but definitely just use up your paints in another painting. So I hope you guys like this video. Let me know what you think of these colors down in the comments below, and I will definitely be doing another one with um, each of these along with that red for the background next time. 
So hopefully you guys like that one too. Uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell for notifications. I do put out three videos a week and I will see you all in the next one. Thank you so much for watching today.